Good morning, Church. Welcome back to our daily devotion inside today. I want to share with you a devotion entitled A Preparation Perspective. It means the way you look at things, the way you do things, the way you live your life, you must have a right perspective and you prepare for it. 2 Corinthians 5 verses 9 to 10 says, Paul writes, So we make it our goal to please Him, that is Jesus Christ, whether we are at home in the body or away from Him, for we must all appear before the judgment seat of Christ, so that each of us may receive what is due to us. For the things done while in the body, whether good or bad. You know, if you and I are wise, you will live each day with the truth uppermost in your mind. That is, you will have a preparation perspective. What you do today how you live your life today, how you behave today, how you follow Jesus today is a preparation for tomorrow. You got it? All right. Think about this. You don't just wake up one morning and say, oh, I decided to be a lawyer, or I decided to be a doctor, or I decided to be an architect, or an engineer, or so on and so forth. No. You make this that decisions years earlier, and you work on towards that now. Let's be clear, as Christians, you are not working to earn your salvation. You receive your salvation when you receive Jesus into your heart as your God and personal Savior. Amen? But, and, and, but you, when you're in Christ, you will earn a heavenly reward one day when you and I meet Him face to face. And salvation is the foundation that you build on. Because you have Christ Jesus in your life, you have the foundation, you build your life for tomorrow that God will reward you and I. Amen? And the Bible says, For no one can lay any foundation other than the one we already have or laid. That is Jesus Christ. Paul Then Paul also goes on to say, in 1 Corinthians chapter 3, verses 12 to 15, he says, Anyone who builds on that foundation may use a variety of materials gold silver jewel wood hay or straw but on the judgment day the fire will reveal what kind of work each builder has done the fire will show if a person's work has any value if the work survives the builder will receive a reward but if the work is burned up the builder will suffer great loss. So the builder will be saved, but the, the, like someone barely escaped through a wall of flames of fire. When you stand before God, or when I stand before God, we have two options, rewards, rewards ready for you and I, or regrets. Rewards waiting for you and I, or regrets. Or we hear from Jesus Christ, well done, good and faithful servant. Enter into my joys or depart from me, for I know you not. So, best to have a preparation perspective now. Very important. Build a preparation perspective now for tomorrow, for your destiny in Christ Jesus. Amen. You get it? Let's pray. Father, we pray that you help us to have a preparation uh, perspective for tomorrow. One day when I see Christ or when we see Christ, we ask you to bless this day as we commit ourselves to you. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. God bless you and you have a great day.